and welcome back. I'm here, I'm wearing green, green is my favourite colour and tomorrow is St. Patrick's Day so guess what we're going to do? The makeup! So I wanted to do a green makeup look with a little bit of gold and yellow because St. Patrick's Day is Irish originally and it's all about the green and the gold so that's what I'm attempting. I have a look in mind, let's see how this works out. I zoom you in a bit and then we start. By saying I zoom you in a bit, I mean quite a lot so you see my whole face with no makeup on which is really nice and I have no idea what my hair does here, I didn't ask for it. I guess we have to ignore it, so I'm sorry and I, I apologize, so let's start. One, two, three, four. I start by applying my foundation with a sponge just to have a bit more coverage. And don't forget the neck. Then on to concealer, just in the normal places, underneath the eyes, around the nose, down the bridge of the nose and on my chin. And I also blend that in with the sponge. To set everything I used a big fluffy brush and some powder and I used that everywhere I used the concealer before. And as always I brush my brow through and then I fill them in. Now on to the fun bits. I started with the cream eyeshadow, I started with the gold in the inner corners and then I used the green on the outer corners of my eye. Then I used the bright yellow in the inner corners of my eye and a little bit down my eye and then a vibrant green on the outer corners of my eye. because we want a nice gradient I used a color that's right in the middle of those two colors and blend that in. And with every look I like to blend the harsh edges so everything looks perfect and nice. Because I wanted to have a bit more definition in the outer corners of my eyes I used a slightly darker green just to emphasize this. Whenever I put on eyeliner I look terrified as hell so I put a green in the waterline and also I wing this out a bit and also underneath the eyes. I don't want the lines to be harsh so the keyword is blending. To brighten up my eyes I used the gold just in the inner corners of my eye and slightly underneath. I used the same color on my cupid's bow to highlight this area. To make this look even more interesting I used a gold liquid eyeliner and I applied it underneath the green. As per usual, just black mascara on top and bottom lashes. Mm -hmm. 
To stick with the green theme, I applied some green mascara and I would love to say that I bought this just for the sake of this video, but no, I have such kind of things in my cupboard. I used that on my lashes and I also made a gradient on my eyebrows. I wanted to have something on the cheeks so I used a bright red cream blush and just apply a little bit on the cheeks. Never forget to highlight this is a gorgeous golden shade from Zoeva and it's really great and shiny and oh my god. We can't forget the lips, so I apply a green. This is actually an eyeshadow pencil. I apply this in the inner corners of my lips and then I apply a yellow liquid lipstick just in the center. I used a lip brush to blend everything and it worked really well. I also applied some more of the yellow shade to brighten everything and I blend until I was happy. I needed some more gold so I applied Vaseline on the top of my lips so the glitter I wanted to put on has something to stick onto. Is this highlight really enough? I don't think so. So I applied some Vaseline on top of my cheekbones and some glitter as well. These are slightly bigger than the ones I used on my lips but they look gorgeous. And then you're done. That's it. So that's it for today's video. I hope you like this look. If so, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up down below. Just click that button, it won't hurt. And also, if you want to, leave a comment down below and telling me what you want to see next from me. And as always, here are two more videos that you can click, watch them, like them, share them, do whatever you want with them. And also, the button here, click that you subscribe to me and you see this face more often. I would love to see that. And for now, I wish you a happy St. Patrick's Day. Bye.